Cleveland Browns cornerback Greg Newsom was robbed at gunpoint for his vehicle. The robbery happened at a filter what? At a filter experience on West Superior Avenue Avenue in Cleveland. This makes the second Browns player to be a victim of a crime in the last two days. They licking the Browns. Gee, pause. That's crazy. Yeah, pause. Demetric Felton and his car stolen on Sunday. Newsom is in his third year in the NFL and has made 26 starts with the Browns over the past two years. Damn. Poor young man. Yo, what happens if you have, like, full coverage and I'm just driving and someone uh, uses a gun to rob my car for me? Like, do I get a new car if I call yeah. my insurance? Like, what? Yeah. Like, yeah. Are you calling like, the police? Hey, fuck yes. Oh, well, then you're going to get everything. Especially if I have a description on hand. Especially a That's the best. And, and yeah, he's going to give him the mugshot. I, I love it. <laughs> you're definitely getting <laughs> packed out it. after the stream That's for right. future telling. I love it. <laughs> He um, he's writing everything down. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. Oh, he's reporting everything he sees. He had hey, two crazy. earrings on his left ear. He had a chain on or something. Uh, I'm not even sure. You know, most football players got chains now. It was probably a nice <laughs> car. <laughs> you said that. So <laughs> I want. I want to see the details of where this happened because a lot You're of car dead. robberies happen at gas stations, bro. Yeah, that's like the the, hey, the gas. Like, come here, homie. The gas station is the number one place you should be super situationally aware because that's, that's where you're I don't like even get out of that gas station. I make yeah. the bitch pump the gas. <laughs> oh my god! You the evil world bro, after he got robbed. People were giving me shit because Riley pumped the gas the other Fuck day that, and on stream, and they're like, "Oh, a man always supposed to pay and pump the gas." Yuri. You want to know what? <laughs> you don't touch that gas. You want to know where this type of shit happens? She that gas. You was you a celebrity. You want to know you where you guys should get gas at? Costco. You'll where never get robbed at Costco gas, and it's the best price. Don't you have to have Costco, like the card? You yeah. don't got an account with Costco? You have no. to wait in a line, I'm too. I'm saying, that one of your busy. accounts doesn't have a Costco card? No. What? No. I don't, I don't have those type of ladies. <laughs> yeah, when you're at a <laughs> gas station, guys, look around, dude. <laughs> I wanted to take but it But it looks like this didn't happen again. Rock. It happened at a filter experience? I just what considered the hell? everything. <laughs> it's a, oh, it happened at a restaurant. Oh, yeah. Oh, cool. at the filter experience. Ah. You know what that is? No, it's no. only got three stars. I've never been <laughs> Why'd such you a say place? like you recognized oh, it? Yeah. Huh? I remember once Cleveland. you get to a get to a certain, you know It looks nice. A certain like status, but like you can't eat at a three star restaurant. <laughs> Not everyone's looking at Yelp reviews. Target. And also I'm definitely I looking at Yelp reviews. Even at right now, I would like, be at yeah. Louisiana fried chicken with my billions. Fuck you, be DoorDash. Not at nah, the filter. Man. Hell yeah. I'm DoorDash, yeah. I'm, yeah, I'm not going to be in that motherfucker. Yeah. I'm not paying no DoorDash person 15 Me bucks right to now, bro. my shit. I can't eat at no three-star restaurant, though. <laughs> exactly. You right now? Yeah, bro. All right. You go there? In you got a what? Flacco, you didn't even know that steaks could cost more than $65. I don't yeah. want to hear that cap I know, ass right? shit. Yeah. When was the last I don't time? I want to hear that cap ass shit. So look, let me ask you a good question because me and you be eating at nice places. And uh, shit. Oh, Would thanks you? for excluding Josh and I out of this too. Josh I'm eats down, fucking bro. Jewish food and you eat Russian <laughs> food and that's it. <laughs> what the Is fuck? that true, Josh? Is that true, they Josh? Only <laughs> eat, they only eat ethnic food eat, to eat. their culture. That's not that's even true. <laughs> it's included in our diets probably. They really only far, eat I'm not even sure Josh eats culture. Jewish food. I'm what so is sorry, Jewish? Like, Josh does eat, does I, Jewish food, right? What right now, that? I had a hot flash uh, thinking about making know. Sounds like cheese. saying that shit. That's why. Hey, so what? Would you ever eat a Black Angus ever again? Black Angus. Black Angus. You, you never ate a Black Angus? Angus? I have. It's like a steak red lobster kind of place. It's kind of whatever. Mm. I like better steaks. Huh? Yeah, a little bit. That might be better than Outback, supposedly. A little bit. I don't think so. The reason why They're I like say damn this near is on the same we, level. The reason I say this is because we were talking about lamb chops, and yesterday I was trying to figure out where I should take my family to eat, and like it's right around the corner, and I saw that they had lamb chops, and I was like, damn. Tastes I'm, like metal. I, <laughs> <laughs> no, I just want to go eat lamb chops, and I'm considering if Black Angus is a good choice. Chat, what do you, you guys do think? Better. Icon, let me ask you this. If you don't have a uh, pistol, Pete, with you, if you're just chilling, right, driving around, I would never. And the same situation, ever leave my friend Peter, behind ever. If Peter is just left behind at home, all lonely, and the same situation happens to you, you're just giving up the car, right? I would never be in that situation because my friend Pete is, he's, anyways, yeah. <laughs> Uh, yeah. I, I just feel like in most situations, you're, you're better if off Pete just giving up the car I am and calling there insurance. We go. See, look, better question, Yuri. What if Pete malfunctions? If Peter has a meltdown in the middle of our shit, we are fucked. 
and I'll probably <laughs> die because when Peter pops out, so everyone's tripping. What if Peter has nothing to do with this, and this is maybe some type of insurance scam that the Browns players have in on? <laughs> and these fools are all just licking themselves? That's Not wild. licking themselves, but hey, I go get a new car, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> this one just needs to disappear. How suspicious Damn. that it happens to two uh, Browns players in like a month, it's like. It has? <laughs> if four no. more play, if one more players player gets two? hit in the yeah, next week. Yeah, it's been week, two. Oh, shit. We know that it's a Damn, niggas fan. know the Browns players is just licks. Or, yeah, that's what yeah I'm saying. they've been following them around like, all right, these guys have nice cars. What you see a nigga play for the Browns, get on his ass. That's what niggas <laughs> are saying at this point. Job. Well, what's it in Stay Cleveland? Yo, the that's why, because Cleveland don't play. The Browns has to; they have to get it back in blood at this point. <laughs> they, that's a fact. Because they look kind of crazy, like Almighty saying they look yeah. like a, the lick of the nigga, town. Y'all better send, y'all better send some linemen. <laughs> 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 y'all better send some linemen, niggas, some niggas on the D line to the trap, nigga, and get it cracking. <laughs> Fuck you, me. Y'all better get y'all linebackers out here. Nigga. Tackle some people. What Man, nationality is the person that owns the Browns? White. No, white. but what kind of white? White he's with white. an H in front of me. If white. he's Italian, oh yeah. He's white. What? If he's Italian, they're pulling the scam. They're definitely. That's so suspicious. Right? Though. If he's like issues, like so. an Eastern European or something, or like a Western European. Imagine we're all pulling I'm the same scam. Like Russian that's so suspicious. Or Armenian. Italian, or maybe Armenian. No, no Islam. Not they're Americans. Yeah, they're Russian or Armenian is a big. Oh, Jimmy, oh, <laughs> Jimmy Haslam, an American. Oh, he's a short sure racist. Look at his face. <laughs> I, I feel that man, man, an American God. business on, James, James Arthur man, come James, James Arthur is going to have to send some of his homies and not hate niggers he, listen, Jimmy has bro he for sure <laughs> racist him <laughs> definitely how positive are you with that statement 10 absolutely man 10%? 10 10 out of 10 yeah. oh 10 out of 10 10 out of 10, 9, 10, 10. 100%, 100%. Absolutely. absolutely huh Flacco okay. man come on huh. no bro. question huh Flacco you can tell that part. No, t- you see, you see just the racism. Bro, just, Jones, come on, bro. You Let's see the racism. Yeah, 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 come on, bro. Uh, that's called. <laughs> but yeah, that was wild. You, you, he you was ten years old. Say, I don't give a fuck. 17? Ten. Seventeen. He went with his dad. He didn't know no better. So yo, <laughs> this is this is this is judging a book by its cover, right? Nah. Yes. Now let's look at D. Let us look at his wife. Yeah, let's, let's look at this girl. Let's see, Fl- Flacco. Mm-hmm. Give it to me. Oh man, oh, she man, ain't playing no now. games. Uh, of course she's racist. Come on. Oh yeah, look at her. Yep. She definitely yeah. the way her hair sit on her head. <laughs> yep. The she way hates her... those colored people, <laughs> bro. The hates way those them. wrinkles are in her jaw, for sure. Mm-hmm. Let's look at her child. James you you can see what le- what James words Oakley. she says more. She's speaking based to every off manager, the wrinkles. Bro. She's speaking to every manager. <laughs> at, at. She's looking at, at your nearest black person. She's looking at your nearest colored person in the room right now with that face. Man, come on, man. This is crazy. Listen, come on, bro. <laughs> I don't want to ever give Flacco too much credit, but more likely than not, most of the majority Foot, owners yes. in football, if not racist, come from some type of racist background Facts. because it, they come from older money and yeah, and they're usually southern. Usually tied up. They're usually southern white people who yeah. can afford to own a that. football team, and they're but, usually racist. And also, they're in the their literal business is. Owning, owning people black people and, and making contracts them with them and right and yeah so they're gonna feel a certain way so she's 68 the, i don't disagree with crazy. this is the new slave owners I, it's hard for to disagree with that one yeah these but are the new someone slave like owners. robert Kraft. i don't think he's racist i don't know too much about him now listen his name sounds hella racist it's hard yep. for me to believe bro, that an 80 year old white man bobby bobby Kraft. Dude, he spends his Rice. time working in Bobby trying Crash, to get, like, Meek Mill out. Sale. Meek Mill's good friends with him. Who? He's Meek. Liberal. Yeah, of course. Not he's a fucking too. liberal. Here you go with this shit. <laughs> <laughs> this fucking liberal shit, bro. This nigga's breaking hilarious. News, breaking news, though. 